Let's follow a typical workflow, starting in Test Manager, defining a new test case, in this case for the Bing search engine, to validate the number of returned search results. We add an Axe ID to link it to the Axe spreadsheet layouts. Save and close. We can now switch into Excel to build out how this test would look step by step. First of all, we select the windows or pages that make up the application. In this case, Home and Results. We take each one in turn, providing an ID for the row of data within that spreadsheet layout. We provide a description for documentation purposes, and then a series of actions and data associated with the objects on that screen. In this case, setting the search term to coded UI tests, and hitting the search button then move to the second phase of the test and in this case we build out the test itself using the lower level components or pages. We provide an ID, description and start point and now we can say which subtest will make up this particular test case. Firstly, entering the search term on the home page and secondly, entering the results and checking the return value. The spreadsheet definition is complete, so we can switch now to the Axe user interface to generate the code and documentation for our test case. This shows the documentation in natural language. We can then execute the code to ensure it performs correctly. and check the results. In this case we have a fail. We can drill down into the Axe results, check in the process as we go, and we see here that validating the count or expected match was mismatch. So let's copy in the actual value back into our spreadsheets to update the test. save it and when we're happy regenerate the code and execute the test case a second time. In this case the test passed correctly. Let's see what Axe has actually generated. Firstly in the test case itself you'll notice that the steps have been completed in this case with the natural language documentation that Axe created. Secondly, in Visual Studio, you can see the actual C-sharp code that Axe has created to implement that test case. Expanding the test set is a matter of just adding new rows to the spreadsheet layouts. In this case, longer search term and no search term at all. We build these test cases in Axe, switch back to Test Manager, and Axe has automatically added the references to those particular test cases, so we can add those to our test plan.